We're coming to you live from Tokyo, Japan at the world famous Krokyo Dome. You know, world famous doesn't mean as much as it used to since most of the world is a charred wasteland, but you get the meaning. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Galaxy Chaos face off against the Tokyo Terminators. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. And, and these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. First down, you know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. When I personally think the ginormous guy is compensating for something, he should apply for the Mutant Volleyball League. Hey, yeah, uh, don't give the fans any ideas. The commission already spends all day on Twitter shooting down rumors. Second down and ten. Brick shit house. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, tell him me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. Come on, man, you gotta catch that. I don't catch anything, Grim. I'm retired. Second down and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. And this guy is... Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. It's in their programming to reject that particular move, Bricks. Two on the nose. That and, uh, well, the robot. That previous play never happened because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. with the brain scrambler. And 
and it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And that'll be second down and four. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. And he punched his way out of that tackle. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Grim. Second down and more. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. Man, it's still edible now. Just gotta scrape off the charge parts. Third down and six. just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, NFL is... And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. Second down and five. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. A great run for a nine-yard gain. Third down, and the punter is warming up. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. First down and five. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a
a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's first and ten. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver, knocking down. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Quarter one comes to an end. If they don't get it together, this game is going to turn into a rout. And it's first and ten. That's a pass and catch for a new game. Then how is it a pass? Second down and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Nice hit. Second down and seven. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. They want more points, so they're going for two. And perfect pass for two points. That's a piece of art right there, Bricks. Yeah, man. The QB turned the defense into an abject mess. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks. He can go all the way. He's at the 20. The 10. And the defense is on his heels. First down and one. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Just a shitty pass to absolutely no one. He could go all the way. Well, back to the bench. He dropped it, you butts. Third down and ten. And they stack the line, and he gets his bell rung for a yard. There's no reason to go for it here, but they do anyway. He is rope one speed in game. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Second down and ten. Almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big port of John in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. Don't nobody light a match. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. And he just and he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. And 
And they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. Third down and, well, good luck. for two. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Yeah, it got blown to shit. Speaking of blow, where's my little bile? When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. If he is getting killed by a chainsaw, <laughs> Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. So you can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? Quarterback passes for a touchdown. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he made this clothing company, Lukewarm. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die.
Second down and more than the QB would like. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. It's about a three-yard pickup. And that'll bring up third and one. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Well, why go for one when you can go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. That's a beautiful pass for the conversion. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. There aren't too many players that fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. Second down and two. He had it for a second there. Third and two. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And 
it's first and ten. Second down and two. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. out there. I like this. They're going for two. The QB threats the needle for two points. Oh, and the fans really loving his dancing out there, but they need to be careful. One drop of blood gets on and they can kiss their skin goodbye. for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. First and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. They're going for two points. points to their score. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! First and ten. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. It's the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. <laughs>
the third quarter has ended and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Just a shitty pass to absolutely no one. Second down and ten. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! They want more points, so they're going for two. And it plows forward for the two-point conversion. They'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. Nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was. be second down and four. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Second down and long. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And he runs it in for the touchdown. And this rip is definitely on the tank. That was a bogus penalty. Third down and offensive. It's time to put the ref out of his misery. Third down and the QB is saying his prayers. Get your motor running. It's chainsaw time. <laughs> and that's why you should never think about mine unless it's that kind. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Yeah, got blown to shit. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever.
And it's first and ten. Jumps the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Oh, with a brutal hit. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Third down and, well, good luck. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Missed the beat for Brad Fair with a ball and didn't fall down. No, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. Bam! Gutsy run for the conversion! They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It, it means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that'll bring up second and one. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. And he's off to the races. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! season, dumbass. Actually, I think he's talking about the time more dirty trick that the defense just played. Still a dumbass, though. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two foot pots all the time, Grim. 
The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bender right now. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. To see if they can get something going here. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? And he just wrestles away. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> and it's first. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Ah, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. And they line up for the extra point. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. And it's first and ten. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and get the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. free and has open field in front of him he's in the 20 and he steamrolls through the defense on that play and picks up a nice chunk of yardage the kicker died on that play and that's terrible now what do they do well another player will assume the kicking role for the remainder of the game the coach is praying he won't need a long field goal to win this one And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. 
Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The Tokyo Terminators win the game today. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? I paid for admission. I expect girls dancing on a pole or something. Girls, man, I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Follow me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Britton Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every other...